fact, it's a big deal. As hospitalizations rise, Premier François Legault is targeting the unvaccinated. They put a very important burden on our health care uh, network. So, he says, a tax is coming for those who aren't vaccinated, but with little detail on how the tax will work, only that it will be significant. This is a total improvisation from the Premier. Obviously, he looked at some polls and said, hey, we should be coming up with this idea. Now people will be talking about this new policy idea, maybe not spending too much time thinking about, you know, why Dr. Arruda uh, uh, left. That's Dr. Horatio Arruda, who just last night resigned as Quebec's public health director. In a letter, Arruda says he's been the source of much criticism lately, writing that it is undoubtedly causing some erosion of public support. Criticism over how the province has handled Omicron, including reinstituting the curfew. Arruda offered to resign. Legault accepted. He could have just refused this or, or, or talk him out of it. So I think that for the premier, it's probably convenient politically. At first, Deruta was something of a pandemic celebrity who delivered grim news with personal anecdotes and folksy charm. But as the pandemic continued, the fact Deruta often appeared alongside the premier raised questions. The distinction between uh, detached scientific advice and the pol political decision making I think it's blurred. All of this is happening as the province's hospitals deal with the worst pressure of the pandemic. If it continues and we cannot handle the, all those hospitalizations, we might have come to a point where we're going to have to ask ourselves, can we offer all those treatments to all the patients that walk in the door? A scenario that also raises pressure on Quebec's government. Sarah Levitt, CBC News, Montreal.